Hello guys, so in this lesson I'm going to show you how you can fix the pink errors on lost script in Unity. Sometimes it's because of the uh, way Unity is set up, you might actually begin to see some of these materials get entirely pink. Sometimes the particle systems also get pink. So let me just go ahead and show you quickly how you can fix that. So the first thing you should look into if you want to fix this is to understand how the asset was built. So let me just go ahead and uh, yeah, let me just maximize this column right here so we can see, you know, uh, we can see everything. So right now on the project view, if I go to assets and I go to shader graph, these are all the custom built shader graphs that exist for the lost script. So, and if it's the first time you're installing this, sometimes you notice all these are white. Now, what I mean is you won't see this uh, bluish uh, looking icons. They are all white. So you need to fix that immediately. And if you actually look at the shader graph names, we have the auto mask for the background, for the caustic, which I think it's for the water. Okay, we have the water on lit. We have the shader graph for the glyph and the particles. So you need to make sure that all these are kind of like blue. That means you have to save them. So to save them, that's very straightforward and simple. If you click on the shader graph and go to open shader, what you're going to do is to go right here where it says save asset. I'm just go ahead and maximize this so we can see this where it says save asset. Just click on save asset once and you're done. That's it. So once you click on save asset, you notice that your asset becomes bluish. That means it has saved it into memory. And what that means is you could actually set the shader on the standard on the uh, shader tab. So what do I mean by we could set the shader? So let's go ahead and click one of these pink, you know, errors shaders. Now this is for the vegetation in the game this is for vegetation like that. It's for one of the, uh, sorry, I think it's this one. It's, yeah, good. So it's for one of the trees. So and the vegetation uses a wind lit. So that's the shader that it uses. It uses a custom shader from the shader graph. So if we go right here and click on the material that's giving us the error, which is this guy right here, this material has given us that pink error. If you click down on standard, you could actually go to the uh, universal render pipeline. Uh, not here. Sorry about that, guys. We could actually go here and see our shaders. Where are they? All right, so good. Sorry, guys. Under shader graph, not the URP, but under shader graphs, which are these shader graphs, right? These same shader graphs. So if we click on these shader graphs, you can see all the graphs, custom graphs that have been created. So I'll just click on the shader graph vegetation wind lit, and this should fix that error. Another way you can quickly fix the error is to upgrade the entire project materials to use the universal render pipeline materials. This will find and fix any of those pink uh, error materials. In case you don't find those pink error materials, you can always pick from uh, one of these uh, errors. And what you can always do is to find out which of these materials is giving you the error. For instance, for the FX, for the FX day, I was able to fix my particle system by, you know, clicking the drop down for the particle system and dragging down the curves where it says glow you can see that we have the shader graph for the particles lit which is also right here which is shader graph particles lit so you can actually select and go to shader graphs and you can see the uh, shader graphs particle lit so you can set the specific shaders that are built for the pipeline remember the lost script uses the universal render pipeline asset which uses the uh, new Unity's way of building the shader using the shader graph and uses the 2D renderer to build the shader graph. So that's one way you can actually do that. So you can select, you know, the object on the scene that's giving you the error and you can check from one of the uh, pre-built shaders and then assign the proper shaders. So the uh, another way to fix this error is to actually go to uh, edit and go to uh, render I think it's render pipeline. Yeah. So we go to the universal render pipeline and say up upgrade project materials to universal render pipeline materials. Now, once you do this, it might solve the pink issues for you, but it might not solve the uh, use of the appropriate materials. Remember for the lost script, we have all these custom built materials for the shader graph. So you might not be getting the actual, you know, lighting effects for uh, that uh, material if we do it that way. 
what I mean is it could actually it might actually do this for you. It might actually go to the universal wellness pipeline and do this. Right? It might actually do this or it might go to the universal render pipeline or select the uh, 2D or you know use the sprite lit. You can actually notice the difference that this is actually responding to the light fully while this material right here is just a uh, basic dull sprite lit uh, shader. So remember, you can actually solve that, but you're not using the appropriate shader. To use the appropriate shader, we can get down to the shader, click on the shader graphs, and let's use the uh, sh shader graph vegetation wind lit, and this will actually use the appropriate shader. This shader has textures, it has normal maps, it also has an occlusion maps, and it also has a wind direction. You can also change and customize the wind direction to increase the uh, Let's see wind direction right here and do that also the wind scale and let's also add the wind speed and you can see that let's go ahead and just play this in the scene and you can see that uh, that shader is going to do that uh, effect <laughs> and it's actually making this real uh, wobbly this can actually be used for water and you can actually uh, do that so that's how you can fix the errors on your uh, lost crypt unity project i hope this helps someone somewhere so in case you're having other errors just let me know what errors you're having and we can actually go ahead and look at that for me i'm having errors with the character when the character is trying to run if you actually notice her legs one of the legs isn't actually bending i think that has a problem to do with the uh, ik and how i've set up the ik or most likely i might have messed up with something i'll just look into it and see how i can actually fix that error so just to remember you can look through the scene and uh, the scene is properly built if you're using the universal render pipeline you would actually have you know those errors that uh, exist so let's just go back here and quickly run through our scene just to make sure everything is working okay super apologies for my system i'm actually using a, an old system i'm saving up some cash to actually buy a new one and hopefully this will be better so uh, yeah we're having these uh, materials show and i think based on my knowledge these might be okay so uh, just let me know in the comments if this is okay and uh, yeah, thanks very much for watching and I'll see you in the next Unity Quick Tip.